when you remember that you don't own the company. This reminds me of that book Software Craftsman by Sandro Mancuso, whose cult following escapes me everything happening at the company is basically your fault because it's your job as a dev to convince everyone higher up that your solution is the way to go and don't consider yourself an employee but basically a freelance because career. Well I got better to do with my life. I'll do my job as best as I can and give the best advice as I can during my work hours. Beyond that, I frankly don't care. Yup that's professional growth right here. Take care of yourselves lads. Here is my analogy if you rent an apartment and you have extra money at the end of the month, you don't pay more rent. If you own a home, you could benefit from paying down your mortgage, though. When you're an employee, working more than your 40 hours is just paying extra rent. You get nothing out of it. I'm not saying don't work hard, but don't give a company that much of yourself. Yep. I was unhappy at my last job, and finally realized I had one lever I could pull that the owners didn't I can just walk away, and get a different job. If you're the owner, you have to wind it down, go bankrupt, or find someone to buy the business.